What's up YouTube, Chana D, your techno dad here with a quick video. A few people have asked me to explain speaker impedance when it comes to matching speakers and amplifiers. So we're going to be talking about ohms today. I'll start with this, I am not an electrician and I will not be talking about Ohm's law. There are plenty of videos about that on YouTube if you want to learn more about it. I will be talking about how speaker impedance relates to matching speakers with amplifiers or AVRs. And in true Techno Dad fashion, I made some slides to illustrate the point. When you're looking at amplifiers, you'll see power output ratings like this, 55 watts per channel with an eight ohm load when two channels are driven. In fact, all these ratings are going to be with two channels driven, so I'm not going to continue to repeat that. Just know that we're talking about two channels driven in this video. This particular amp also outputs 70 watts per channel with a six ohm load and 105 watts with a four ohm load. So when you see these numbers, you can interpret the information like so. The amp is stable at four ohms, which means you can connect 4 ohm, 6 ohm, and 8 ohm speakers without issue. However, if you have a 2 ohm speaker, you should not connect it to an amp that's only stable at 4 ohms. You're going to have some issues. Now, if you see an amp that has a power output that's expressed in 8 ohms only, I would assume the amp is only stable at 8 ohms. So I would not connect speakers that are lower than 8 ohms. I would just connect 8 ohm stable amp to 8 ohm speakers and call it a day. So basically you can connect an equivalent or higher ohm load to the amplifier or AVR. Do not connect a lower ohm speaker with a higher ohm rated amp or AVR. Well, that's it. There you guys go. Basic guidelines for you out there that don't really know about it. So I hope this answers your question and helps you out. Please leave any questions down in the comments below or on whichever social platform you like to use. If you like this video and found it helpful, smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Once again, my name is Chana D. I'm your Techno Dad and I'll see you next time.